like how gorgeous is this place i'm staying it's called glen cottage i absolutely love it oh my god you guys i cannot even yes just arrived i'm so tired but i had to give you a tour this is the master it's so rustic i mean you guys know like how i love rustic oh my god i love this place guys oh just how gorgeous is her kitchen oh Rufaro. guys the bathroom is a freaking gorgeous place look at that i can't even my bags there's another room um let me take you to another room downstairs this is another room as well so gorgeous i'll do a proper tour tomorrow when i've rested for the outside part right, yeah. the day i arrived in zim don't think i've showed my face hi guys <coughs> i've just been wrapping presents this one is for my grandma uh, this one is for my sister this one is for my other sister um and this one is for my youngest sister and then that's for my uncle and his wife that's for my grandma no yeah that's for my grandma yeah that's for my grandma and that's for my brother i'm getting confused now yeah so everyone is sorted i can't wait to place these under the christmas tree at my sister's house super excited for christmas um our first one together in such a while so yeah let's not talk a lot in this vlog because there's a lot for me to show you guys i want to show you the outfit of the day it's inspired by hazel's outfit that she wore when we went to this uh restaurant in the summer for our bed for well our birthdays but yeah let me show you this outfit. it's gonna be weird with this mirror but anyway this is it i'm wearing this skirt from primark which you guys know and this t-shirt from zara yes girl and these um sandals i don't know if you can see them yes yes they're from um top shop I'll see you guys later. Eh, eh, eh. No, they're from Asos. my grandmom's house, the house that I literally grew up in. And whenever I come, I feel like I see my mom because that's my mom's pig. And that's Tanya's mom, if you guys know Tanya. And that's our grandmom. Um, yeah, love, love coming here. It brings back so many memories. Okay. So, I eat each flavor, eat lemon. I eat pineapple. Commonly orange. Pineapple, I've had Oh, it's like Guys, so I'm at my grandmother's I'm at my grandmother's house. 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 i i i I happy to see me. I'm back again. Yes. Anyway, guys, bye. My brother, Munya, come and meet my vlog. My brother is not very like. Ah, Hello. So, guys, it's my brother Munya. How are you? Um, I'll post his um, Instagram later. Yeah. 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 Hello. 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 I was a social worker yes. at City Council yes. for 37 years. Yes. I've got pension. Yes. Thank you. Bye. Bye. <laughs> and on top of being a social worker, were you not a bishop's wife? Were you a reverend's wife? Yes, I mean, uh, I am a bishop's wife, a reverend man. Yes. So guys, we can only look at her. She can't know. She only looks at her. She's a British accent. We can only hear her go She's like her English is like super good. We actually took after her because she was so well groomed and well mannered. So yeah, guys, 
I'm so happy to be able to follow in my grandmother's footsteps of becoming a social worker. But 37 years, I don't think. Cheers! Delta, yes. Delta, to know what to thank you, Nefante Amagatipa. Nefante, you could not come shack with Delta Zimbabwe. We love our country. It's Viganda <laughs> please. Morning, guys. So it's Christmas Day today, and I'm just at my sister's house, and we're just going to my grandmom's house now. Wait for the glow up, guys. I will not come and die. This is how I look at the moment. Um, but yeah, my nephew is actually asleep. I think he's gonna join us later. He's so tired. He went out last night. Yes, guys. That's Fiki struggling to open the gate because <laughs> she's just being lazy. Not... Ah, buddy, cap. Morning, Fiki. When is the glow up loading? You look dingy. <laughs> <laughs> So current location, Marlborough. Guys, I can't. There was a dog that lived at this house, guys. Yeah, in the man, it's like there's no tomorrow. Kungo Buddha Mota Man. So Tana is about to open Coco's present. Okay. Have you opened yours, Vicky? What did you get? A watch. Mm. I got a watch. This Guys, not just a watch, cap. A Fiorelli watch. Fiorelli watch. Look at the camera when I'm tell so come it. Bona. Bona. Yeah. Guys, guess who's back? Lina is back again. Mm, yes, she's now live. <laughs> ben Lynn works. She was so unwell. She had the cold. This vlog is gonna be so boring because I'm I keep forgetting to vlog and then when I start something happens and because I'm using my phone people want to take photos with my phone it's crazy so I haven't been able to really vlog a lot today is uh, 27th Friday after the boxing day 
just waiting for my friend Tinashe who's coming to pick me up. I haven't seen her in ages, but like she's my girl. Uh, we used to work together and just used to do life together. I just am so excited. We're gonna go to her house and then go to a place called Gem Tree. So I'm hopefully, hope, I'm hoping that I can vlog that. And then later on, I'm seeing another friend again. And then I'm hoping to see my brother later because um, he's due to travel tomorrow. So that'll be good to see him before the airport rush. And then that's it for the day, guys. I'm wearing this dress from Misguided. It's really, really nice. I love it. I got it for my um, trip for my birthday. I never got to wear it. Then I knew this trip was coming around, so I kept it. It's really good. Chains are from Topshop. Um, my earrings are from H&M. And my unit is by Princess Lini. And um, yeah, that's it, guys. Lippy I'm wearing. I don't even know. I think I talked about this lippy in my list, uh, getting ready for work. I know I've got a Mark Cock lippy underneath, and I'm wearing the sandals from Zara. I don't know if you can see them. And my bag, which I unboxed in my previous vlog. Um, yeah. So, yeah, that's that, you guys. And this fan I got when I was traveling from Mioka. So, yeah, just waiting for Tanasha now. Let me show you around. I don't know if I've ever where I'm staying. It's called Glen Cottage. Um, you can book via Rufaro Little Paris on Instagram. It's really nice it's a home away from home i love it here i've really enjoyed staying here um this is like my favorite part it's gorgeous this gazebo thing and those hanging lanterns i just love it guys if you know me you know i leave for rustic oh my god this house is like a built for me yeah so it's amazing here it's hot it's is effing hot i can't like i can't even breathe you can't take a move without being hot so I'm super glad for I can't, guys. Who come bearing gifts such as these are the ones to keep, guys. Like if you're my friend and you haven't brought a bottle of Lauren Parillat, are you even my friend? <laughs> Jokes, guys. I had my friend come over the other day. And we had a bottle of Champolopo. We were singing and dancing by the time we were finished. Yeah. I don't even have a place called Queen of Hearts and it's in, I think it's in Newlands or something. Yeah. Off Enterprise Road. It's amazing. There's like little restaurants here. I legit love it, you guys. I'm out with my sisters. It's like my first proper night out since I've been here and I'm so excited about that because all I've been doing is just seeing people and I really needed to wind down tonight. The vibe here is so, so nice. So we're off to order our food because there's so many restaurants, different ones. Yeah. Guys, so today is the last day of my trip. My plane leaves at about 1.40 a.m. on the 30th, but I have to check in today on the 29th at about 10, 10 p.m. I feel so down because this is where home is and this is where family is and when you've had so much fun with your family it's always really hard sorry about my voice i just woke up i'm waiting to get my hair done as well don't know why i left it this long but she happens i am just sitting by the balcony no but not by the balcony by the gazebo um one of my favorite places at this cottage is just sitting here and taking all these views in, in some posh houses here and it's just so inspiring especially you know it's really inspiring i love it so i'm just waiting for the two guys doing my hair they're delayed but yeah i'm gonna miss this place so much love love glen cottage there's no doubt i'll be back here anyway guys i'm gonna go having a cup of tea if you remember this is how i started my day again when i arrived here and i'm gonna end it the same way Man, her, she won't believe me And it's so, it's so Said the paper, she don't see what I see But every time she asks me Do I look okay? I say
obviously I just want to give all the glory to God and just say thank you God for you know taking me to Zimbabwe and back safely in good health um, I'm just really grateful to God for just allowing me to be with the family um, over Christmas and everything it was really really good so I just got home our flight arrived around 3 p.m. then obviously this immigration process and then after that <coughs> I called um, and he had to take me to Scar where I left my car and then drove quite slowly because I was really tired and then got to Tesco, got a few bits for the house because there was nothing here. I needed some tea so I had to buy milk as the first thing. So I'm here now, I'm home. I'm going to end this vlog here and just say you guys, I'm so sorry that I could not do vlogmas like throughout connection in zimbabwe is like a lot like it was just so much and where i was staying i could have used the wi-fi there to upload my videos but i just felt like it was unfair to be downloading such big files and then they end up losing their gigabytes or, or megabytes what do you call them yeah gigs megabytes yeah so i just decided you know what i'm gonna do it when i get home a belated vlog is still a vlog can you catch the glow it's coming from the sun you guys i can't i've got nothing under it's just the sun glow honestly the sun does things to us guys we're just in denial um this hair was done by a guy called dougie and his brother they are based in uh mufakose but they came to me i got the braids from here i've got color 27 color 24 color 30 in there i want it to be like either myself but not the length i need to put them in hot water because they are running a bit they were done in a rush but you know i love them so much can't wait to style them so guys thank you so much for your support i look forward to your comments about this vlog i hope you enjoy it uh and i'll see you in the next vlog bye guys